evil house. This may become a war of attrition. Not so hard, drop them up. Sasuke, please stop. Put them on. Put them on. Put them on. Put them on. I feel there may be a treasure chest nearby. There's even one of you, Ko. I don't recall giving you permission to imitate me. I demand that you cease to exist right this instant. Wait, Kotomi! I don't like this one bit. What a shame. I guess the Sonata line ends with you. <laughs> Are we in some kind of nightmare? Yamato, let me hit you so you can tell us if this is a dream or not. Cut it out! Hey, Brads. Quit playing around and get to chasing those things. I think they're trying to lead us somewhere. I was thinking the same thing. Something is waiting for us at the end of this place. What it is, though? I don't know. If you're to go through this door, please be certain... I feel there may be a treasure chest nearby. Now it's your turn to die, Reiji. <laughs> even has my same glasses. Ah, come on. You're not even gonna try to chase him? No reason to expend that kind of energy. If we just keep on going like we have been, we'll find our answer. Could someone really be waiting for us in the depths of this delusion scape? Why? Something wrong, Asahi? If you're to go through this door, please be certain you're ready. Are we to return the way we came then? There may be a treasure chest nearby. I believe there is something of value nearby. Shall we look for it? I get one now. It's been everybody but Asahi so far. I get it now. Come again? You've got the face of a man who just realized something he wishes he didn't. What's the deal, Dingus? You want to turn back? After we've come this far, fat chance. But there's nothing good waiting for us at the end of this. Asahi. Let's just go. The truth will rear its ugly head soon enough. Shall we proceed through the door? I will happily lead the way. When saving, do be careful not to override a sibling's data.
Welcome. I've been waiting for you. Cannon. I don't recall anyone wishing for you to be waiting here for us. That's true. But I'm not here because any of you wanted me to be. I'm here because I wanted to meet with you. And so I waited. But why? I have a request to make of you. A request? That's right. Just one simple wish. Would you be so kind as to erase my existence from the fabric of this world? Huh? Why would you want that? I am tired. Tired of this day that continues without end. And tired of my eternal role as delusion contractor. Cannon, please tell me, what are you? I'm nothing more than an avatar. An avatar called Delusion Contractor. I am not a delusion in human form, nor am I a human born from delusion. I am simply an avatar. So you're neither a human nor a delusion, but something else. As you are well aware, there are a countless number of me's. Yet we canons all have a single collective consciousness. We share our memories. And should one canon disappear, another will take his place before long. So, as a delusion contractor canon, my consciousness will exist forever. Time will continue endlessly. As an avatar, there is no death. And there is no non-existence. I am a mind adrift in an endless sea of time. And I'm already so very tired. So please, I beg of you. Won't you please cut the chains that bind me to eternity? If that's what you want, why did you come all the way here to ask? You don't know? The answer to that question lies within this delusion scape. The answer? I see. On your way to this place, with whom did your paths cross? Saki, Mibidi, Yamato, Ko, Reiji, Mizuki, everyone but me. They're all just stage dressing. Nothing more than delusory beings imagined and created by me. You made our doubles? I apologize if their presence disrupted your mood in any way. I simply wanted to meet with you here, no matter what. So you created doubles of us to lure us deeper in? Is that so we'd agree to nullify this delusion for you? Absolutely spot on. Please, won't you destroy this delusory labyrinth for me? Shall we open it? It's a safe point. Shall we make use of it before moving on? Are you planning to return then? 